This is a trading war, and I'm going to be trading for 24 hours to figure out how much profit can I make and also teach you how to do it yourself. I'm doing this with one BGL capital. These same steps will apply to any amount of Warlocks trading. Step number one is figuring out items that are in high demand. And also, I need to figure out their prices. Now, to do that, we need to visit the most popular items of that category. I will be trading hand items. And this world is by hand ABT, which is one of the most popular worlds for trading hand items. But I will also visit a lot of other worlds like seeds by GHC and also the worlds that are specific to that item. I will mainly be trading hand items. Well, mainly swords. And the reason for that is because I think they look cool. I don't know. Well, why are you asking so many questions? Okay, let's have a look around. I see a cursed katana. I love cursed katanas. Balrog's tail was sold for 130. Okay. I want to figure out popsicles also because they are swords and they look cool 760 okay okay he's selling katana 780 which is i'm pretty sure super expensive this is what i've gathered from this trading world those katanas have a mediocre demand and the price is around 780 warlocks balrog's tail is in very high demand and sits at 130 price bio blade low demand around 460 price popsicle very low demand and price is 760 obviously these prices are capped Step number two, finding out actual prices. To do this, I will visit the item-specific worlds. So for the course katana, that's sell katana. And the billboard in this world tells me that the actual price is 740 warlocks. Balrog's tail. The main world is by Balrog. And the world tells me that the price is around 115 warlocks. Maybe 120. Poppin' Popsicle Pickaxe. The world is by Poppin' Corn. And the price is confusing because almost no one buys it. But it's either around 730 or 700 Warlocks. Honestly, failed item design. It's a Claymore and it's being from Makes no sense. Bio Wolf's Blade. Worlds by Bio and by Blade. The price sits around 345 Warlocks. With that out of the way comes my favorite part. Step 3. Next step is what I call finding victims. Dun dun dun. Yeah, that, 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 that was funny, isn't it? Anyways, when buying, always try to buy lower than the price that you have assigned. I bought items without using any techniques yet. I will save them for later. Step number four, building a vent shop. This world is trash at the moment, but with some magic, this looks beautiful, but not as beautiful as me. Was that too much? That probably was too much, right? Okay, my bad. The point is catching an eye. It needs to look amazing, but my building skills are limited. So I've put my Curse Katana at 750, uh, Balrog's Tail 120, Balefull's Blade 350, and I put them like this, so it looks like people are buying it, plus it's symmetrical, you know? And people love symmetry. Everything just looks mwah, bellissimo, professional. Step number five, promoting and posting that you are selling these items. First, I hemo discord. So this is buy sell hands. I have a boom. This is how it looks. Cheap items go 66 CG. And then this. It looks beautiful and very engaging. Boom. What? Ah, I see. It has to be capital. Second is promoting on every single billboard that you can. Okay, I'm going offline for a bit. And when I come back, hopefully everything is sold. Hmm, well, that's not amazing, is it? Only one sold. Hmm, I mean, that's 10 more Warlock profit. I dropped every single item's price by 5 Warlocks, which is hopefully what will make it sell faster. I logged in a couple times to buy some more items to stock, and then this happened. Over 600 BGLs lost in a span of 5 hours, because mods didn't like this new function, named Sky Stellar, which was a new and working Wend locator. It was simple to use. All you had to do is type slash find an item's name and the sort method. It then would give you the list of worlds in which you can find that item yes this happened in the middle of my challenge if you're curious what happened check that vid i'm not going to explain it now but let's say i got a little profit from that day two okay it's time to check how much profit that i make and also have something special planned for today okay so almost everything sold so this should be a big profit hopefully if not eh, then unfortunate okay let's check this one 52 diamond locks not bad hey how much are we at right now 79 okay not bad not bad 125 320 650 220 and 10 diamond locks god damn okay two diamond locks and 45 warlocks profit but if i also sell these that's like 30 and 35 so plus 65 three diamond locks okay i actually made three diamond locks in one day Okay, but now I have something special prepared for this. You know how bulletin 
board is like the biggest competition because people put down a lot of random prices like this guy is selling for the same price that i'm selling for so that means he's like my competition well let me change that i will set up these vent shops for my alt accounts and i'll pretend like i'm selling stuff but in reality i'm not selling anything i transfer this world to my alt account and as you can see, I made it so it seems like someone bought this. Even though there was one dirt in it and I bought it for one warlock. Now, I will go to sell katana, open the billboard, and I'll pretend like I'm selling that katana for 750. I made three posts on each. Boom. Now if you open, this is only me. But I'm not done yet. I have multiple accounts. Okay, found someone with a katana. Katana for... Oh, what? For seven? What? For seven diamond locks. That's cheap as fuck. Okay, I just bought a katana for very cheap. <laughs> Hi, mom. And I'ma sell it. Let me put it in the vending machine. Look, 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 look. Oh, this is amazing. 740. Boom. Update. Nice. This is perfect. This is perfect. Go to sell katana. Now, look, 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 look. Sell. Ka uh, sell. 740. Go. 66. C. G. Look at this. Out of every choice, who you gonna buy from? Of course, me. Because other choices are my alt accounts, and this is my actual account, and I sell the cheapest out of everyone. Okay, am, am I a bad person for doing this? Nah, that's fine. It's just a little bit of manipulation. I'm not a bad person, am I? I showed you how to profit big in auctions. Now I'm showing you how to profit big in trading. I'm, I'm, I'm just a good person. I'm not a bad person. Like, I'm totally not profiting myself. <laughs> right? Also, don't don't report me. I'm, I'm pretty sure this is legal, but I don't know if it is. If it's illegal, hey, 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 I I never did it. This is for this is only for entertaining purposes. Okay, okay, okay. Now I need to buy way many more my items, and then I'll do the same thing, and I'll profit big, 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 big. Okay, let me buy some swords. Three fifty. Uh, that's a no. Boom, we got one. Uh, three twenty five for beautiful blade. Yum yum yum. Very nice. Very nice. That's 20 Warlocks profit. Right there. I want this. And that also. Oh, I want both of these. Uh, 320. 325 uh, max. Okay. He said okay. Oh, baby. 325. Baffled Blade again. Don't ever back down when trading. Always know your prices. And don't back down. Buy only cheap. Remember, they will back down themselves. They're weak. The Battle Rock price is still the same. But BO price dropped, I think. Sell BO 340, go 66 CG. Do you sell for? Okay, he's not gonna back down too much because his initial price is super high. Okay, found uh, one Balrog cheap. Nicer, nicer. 110 for one Balrog. It's not much profit with the Balrog. But at least I'm making some profit, you know? I need to trade more. I need to buy a lot of items and then just go sit. I'm, I'm telling you, but, but trading is super simple. This takes absolutely no time at all. Okay, time to check the profits. Let's uh, check out that profit. 29 diamond locks. Not bad, not bad. This is the katana vending machine. Uh, what's this one? I don't remember. 675. Mm -mm -mm, juicy. Already big profit, already big profit. Let's go. 345. God damn. 20. And this was the Voctopian. So this is like 20 also, right? Yep. Okay. 5 diamond locks and 30 warlock profit. Plus the bot worlds. So how much did I earn in total? 537 warlocks. Honestly, better than I expected after being inactive in the trading scene. And also being very dumb.